Welcome to another thrilling episode of What's Up New York. I am Gianna, your host for tonight. And tonight we have a very special guest, singer, songwriter, and full of talent, Mr. Nui Volante. Hi, Nui. How's New York so far? Oh, well, uh, given that I've been here a few hours, pa lang, uh, in, uh, so far, I'm, I'm really loving it, yeah. That's good to hear. Do you have any, uh, any upcoming plans for music? Uh, well... You know, I've, I uh, I said na ano after you know so many years of of kind of veering away from the music scene because you know okay. acting and the TV thing. But uh, you know, I said na 2023 or 2024 I go back to writing music and and recording. So yeah, hopefully. So yeah. what are we looking forward to on TV? Uh well, um, I'm still a part of uh, uh, ASAP. Yes. And uh, Tawag ng Tanghalan, I'm, I'm still one of the judges there. Mm -hmm. um, but, um, you know, every now and then, like some acting uh, stints. Uh, but more often than not, it's just, just, you know, creating music and uh, the, live, the live scene, yeah. Very nice to hear. Uh, so out of curiosity, as a TNT judge, mm -hmm. what do you look for in a contestant? <coughs> I don't really look for anything. Honestly. Anything specific that catches your eye? Well, you know that's uh, it's tricky because sometimes, diba, when when they're singing, you just know it. This, you know, sometimes uh, you hear uh, there's a contestant that's really really good, and then when they sing, somehow it just doesn't hit you, and then there are those who, uh, parang uh, just came out of nowhere and then uh, all of a sudden they were parang they're not doing anything specific or anything like 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 uh, extraordinary but somehow it's just it's just there's just something about them yeah um, it, I think it's more of the singing from the heart right you know yeah how did you start your music career oh well uh, you want the long version or <laughs> Any version that is good uh, enough for uh, us to hear okay, to how yeah. it all started. Well, uh, if I'm being honest, uh, full disclosure, I didn't want to be a singer. Oh. Yeah. Uh, um, what did you want to be? Well, anything but that. Yeah. Oh. Uh, cause, uh, <laughs> That's five, ironic. Uh, around five years old, I, I was already. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I knew how to sing. I could right. hold a tune. My timing was great, um, and uh, of course, being Filipinos. You know, my, my folks were very proud of me, naturally, mm -hmm. and uh, I appreciate that. It's just that, you know, it became more of a, oh, oh, uh, I can sing, the, my, your tita's here, I'll sing in front of them. The grocery store's opening, you know, <coughs> uh, maybe you can sing in their intermission numbers or something like that. So as a five-year-old kid, you know, it, it kind of hit me different. Right. Yeah, I kind of got, I, I guess you could say, turned off with the idea. Um, I uh, I wanted to veer away from the from because you, you can imagine like a five year old kid, you know, s seeing this as as work, as opposed to something that's like inspiring. Not that it's my my folks' fault. It's just that you know they they just, they just really wanted to get me out there, you know, um, and be exposed. Uh, there's. Uh, there was this show, uh, I think it was the Sharon Conetta show, and then the topic was, you know, singers who like, like are trying mm -hmm. to, to make it in the scene, yeah. but, you know, don't get breaks. Siyempre ako na guilty naman ako, di ba? I mean, uh, these people are like, like dying for, for a shot, and then I was given that shot, and I'm not even gonna be, like, at the very least, curious what, what it had to offer. So, you know, the top was... Uh, no, I know that night when I opened my drawer, the, the, the card appeared. So I said, like, okay, maybe it's a sign. I called them. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, fortunately, they, they were still like waiting for my call. And then they said, nah, oh, so yeah, let's do something. So at first, I was doing like mga jingles and and uh, mga, like uh, what's this, uh, uh, theme songs for, for I know, as, as a, as a Someone who's not me. I was named different, pang like Andre Ibarra or something like that. Mm. Yeah, uh, and then, uh, sabi na, okay, you're 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 ready. Let's let's do an album. So we made an album. Um, 
not, not, not for anything. It, it was it was a great album. Uh, he was a great songwriter. Maybe it just wasn't time. So it just wasn't the kind of music that maybe fit me. Yeah. So nothing happened with that, oh. uh, which made me very happy because. Oh. You know, finally, I can like say that I tried my best. Lord, you see in my heart. Hey, I, I, I really did. You know, put my heart into this. Um, I, I did what I had to do, and nothing happened. Maybe, maybe this is you telling me you should go the direction that you want to. So I was so happy. I graduated college. I started like, um, I well, I started. Uh, being uh, stagehands at theater, so I was like uh, mopping the floor, uh, yung mga props, the, the, the mm -hmm. and I was so happy doing that. And then eventually, they wanted me to do, uh, they wanted me to do uh, uh, lights, sounds, and then eventually I was, I was ano na, directing mga small plays and CCP, and I was having the time of my life. I go, I am home. I am finally here where I want to be, and I, I, I kind of said no to a couple of, 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 of offers, and then eventually. Um, one of them, uh, Vico Music, um, said, "Na okay, you don't really need to like do all that stuff. Just just do an album for us." And then, uh, saying, "Yeah, then then you know we, we won't ask anything of you. Just just do an album with us. Just uh, doing this, this, this particular one that, mm -hmm. that you're doing. I don't know, nag 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 guitar and then uh, so." It's like okay, at least, at least, uh, you know, the, uh, my songs are gonna be there. Uh, so I did. And then it turned platinum almost like right wow. away. And then we did a second album, it turned gold. And it's like, oh, but, but even up to that point, hindi ko patanggap that this is what I was gonna do. Right. Parang, okay, this is still a hobby for me. And then eventually, just, you know, I just learned to love like, uh, the, the performance side of things. And then, yeah, yeah. and now I'm here. So New where York. you are now is uh, surprising, well, right? Kinda, kinda, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I mean, uh, needless to say, I, I don't think I deserve to be here because I pushed it away so many times, but uh, I'm still here. Anyway. I think it was your fate. If you pushed it away and it kept coming back, oh, yeah, it was well. definitely your fate. Yeah, so, well, well, I'm, well, one thing's for sure, I'm very grateful uh, to, to, to be here. Yeah. There is a very special guest here, by the way. Mm. She met you in Cebu. And she has been following you ever since. She now currently resides in Long Island, and she's here, and her name is Abby. 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 Hi, Abby. Hi, hi. How are you? Hi, hi. Have a seat, have a seat. Can I have a... There we go. There we go. Thank you. Hi. How are you? How are you? <laughs> How'd you meet uh, Noi back in Cebu? So, as I was graduating before I migrated to New York, I've always been watching, I've always been a fan. This oh my was God. 20, 2003. So this is like 20 years ago. Jesus. Um, you know, Noi would have like three concerts and I was like, you know, all my friends were like R&B, hip hop. And I'll be like, I'm watching Noi. I was like, what? And you were like, who's Noi at that time? You know, it was all new. And then we all fast forward. We were like at the dorm. Every morning, I always played Noi's album. It was like, and I just converted everyone from mm -hmm. R and B to <laughs> hip hop to Noi fans. Oh, thank you. As you can see, you know he's very talented, and so I guess, and I'm just so glad that 20 years after we're gonna meet again. Yeah, thank you, thank you, yes, thank you so course. much for being here. Thank you. Yeah. Hey, this is Noi Valante. What's up, New York? 